What up? How's it going? Brad here. Welcome back to Doken Battle, and today I'm going to show you how to nuke. So nuking is essentially where you use a very powerful character who has a specific set of abilities. A couple characters have it. I don't have any of the really good ones, but a couple of my friends do on here. So I'll show you just an example of what a nuker is. I have the lesser class ones, essentially. So I have this guy right here. And uh, you can see he's actually got a decent ability too. 40% is not bad. Um, anyways, heart pounding fight. Attack plus 7% for every key sphere obtained. So what that means is that if you can manage to change all 23 key spheres, that's how many are on the grid. In case you're one of those 23 all lined up throughout. Uh, there's, uh, so if you can change all of them to one type, and then you can do that, then it just, you can kick ass, essentially. <laughs> Especially if you can get the same type as you. So we're going to try and get all these tech ones, but I'll show you what I'm going to try and do, essentially. So I have a team made up just for this. Uh, well, actually, let me double check, make sure I have a team made up for it. i got to double check that. Should be... Yeah. Right? Agility, tech, tech. Strength. I might want to do another strength on there, actually. We're going to change you out for... Actually, we're going to change a couple guys out, then. This tech, I don't really need him too much. Hmm... But it's good to have the text though because there's no other way for me to do a good amount of damage. But I saw last time it didn't really help anything, so we might. I have tech right there. We're gonna. I don't want to throw another agility on there. I would just keep him if I was gonna throw another one on there. Hmm. Probably should have thought about who else. Was, who else I might want to put on there? Goten's not bad because he can work with it, but. I, oh, I can put this Goku. Yeah, so we'll change it out for that one. And then I'm going to put... Well, if I have one of them as my leader, but I want that HP from the uh, the Goku up here, who's in agility, I need to swap it. That's what I did last time. That's where I messed up. Uh, I didn't upload that video because I was like... Well, because I messed up, essentially. <laughs> so we might keep this Goku. We might... <clears throat> Let's see. I'm just gonna put this Goten and hope it kind of works out. If it doesn't, I'll just explain the process to you. You'll get you'll get the whole general purpose of it still, even if it doesn't work. So don't worry about that too too much. Um, okay. So the thing was, I I normally do any team that I'm gonna use. I like to have the leader have the HP boosted just in case. So if I gotta take a hit, I can take that hit. The way that I'm doing it, I'm not gonna be able to put any other items on besides things that change the key uh, spheres to a certain color. Uh, I'll just show you that in a second. So what you want to do is you want to have strength, though. I wish I had more tech, but I have two of them, so that's not too bad. And I'll have a third one. Okay, that's actually not terrible. Three techs, three strengths, and then I got Gotenks just in case if I can get one off with him to seal that Goku. That'd be amazing. I mean, that's ideally what you want to do. That's the only reason I have Gotenks on most of my teams. But, um, hmm. Okay. Well, I like to keep an HP stat on the top, and for this one, we're going to try and take down that Goku surpassing all. I didn't change that. I didn't mean to change that. So, sorry, my internet is kind of being booty tonight for some reason, so work with me here. <laughs> okay, so we got surpassing all, ultimate finishing move, so it's Z-Hard. Now, the thing you want to do is either have one of these characters as your own. It's a physical Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Vegeta, or it's tech Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Goku. And I never knew these characters were that good until pretty recently. I watched a couple videos on the nuking technique. And a lot of people, not to say that I don't explain it well, it's just, it's not super in-depth. And I want to try and give you a more in-depth look to it on how to do it. Because I didn't really understand it the first time I did it, but I'll get into it. So, I happen to have a friend, Chaos in 7 I don't, I don't know the guy personally, but he happens to have the Goku that I'm looking for. So let me remove that real fast. I want to do, what is it, strength, physical, intellect, tech. Should be the right way. And then, okay, so what it is right here, Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Goku is, so he's got tech allies, so any of the tech allies, so my Whis, my Goku, and my uh, my other Goku, they're all tech. So every time I get a key sphere, it's going to give me 30% boost to their attack. And why that comes in handy is times 23, it's amazing, you can get off like 58 million damage, like legitimately. Um, I tried it last time. And for some reason, this Goku only got me like 600,000, so we're going to give it a shot again. But, there we go. So, you want to have the three reds, because the first guy is going to be physical. So, you want to make sure you can take him down. 
And then you're gonna have the next guy's agility, which is Super Saiyan 3 Goku, and you gotta beat him in three, uh, six turns, not three turns. You gotta beat him in six turns. But, to be honest, he can take you out real easy, even on the first turn. So, the key to it is surviving. If you can get to that second time this Goku, or the other Goku, my leader, comes around, then you can actually do some good, good damage to him, and potentially take him out. So I'll show you what I mean. So we're gonna start this. So I got itchy eye as per usual. I'm super duper tired. That's why there hasn't been an upload in a couple days, because it's just like, ugh. You know what I mean? Okay, so you wanna go for as many of these as you can, obviously, as per usual. So we're gonna do that. I'd like to get that first one, but I'm, there's no get. Ooh, that's perfect right there. I like that. Okay, so we're actually gonna go to this one up here. Just to ensure I get all three of those. That's really good that I got that first. I got that. Ooh, I got that tech Goku 2. Whis. Okay, I'll take Bojack. I'll take Bojack 2. Four. Perfect. Give me one more of these. Key boosts. Okay, so. We're going to get into the battle with this guy. This guy's pretty easy, honestly. As long as you have some decent strength characters, you can take him down pretty easy, even on Z Hard. If he gets a good hit off on you, though, it's going to be a little more. See, like right there, I have no strength characters, which. In my opinion, it does happen, but it's total BS, because there's nothing I can do. Now I have to take a hit no matter what, and I don't like that. But it, it is what it is, so we're going to try and get this guy right here. See, so this should give him a massive boost. He had 19,000 from 2. He normally has about eight to 9,000. Not doing very good so far. Taking a lot more damage than I want to take. See, there's 17,000. Good little chunk, but not enough, really. So we got Bojack now. I might throw Bojack right there. Launch off a big one. Good, okay, we got a super attack. That's gonna do some nice, nice damage. We're gonna give Whis this just to get that 30% boost. Which really didn't seem like much, actually. Oh, because it's physical, that's why. And then, we'll go with either... We'll just go with Red, that's fine. So the key is to get through this with as much HP as you still can have. Because this might do some good damage, but it's not gonna knock him out by any means. Yeah, okay. Come on. <sighs> I didn't get it. I was going for God of Destruction's uh, thing. So this guy right here, we're going to move over this little Goten to absorb this hit right here. See how we changed all of those to green? I might actually swap that Goku, but... No, I don't think I have to, because this little Goten can still put in the work even with green, because he's got that... It's like plus... Yeah, see, it's still decent. Not amazing, but it's decent. And I'll show you what the whole special... Okay, we got two super attacks that should finish him. Hopefully, I can just survive that first couple turns. Maybe get a seal off, that'd be amazing. There we go, that's good damage. Oh god, that's gonna hurt. Even resisted, that's gonna hurt. Oh my goodness. See, 37,000. Okay, that took him out. No, it didn't. Okay, good, it doesn't matter. Oh, okay, it doesn't matter at all. So we're just gonna finish this guy off real quick. Doesn't really matter about preserving because we're gonna change up all the key spheres anyways. So let's see. See, see you can see that boost right there from 2 is 15,000. The key is to get one massive hit off with that Goku. That's the whole key overall. Is you can get one good size hit off and take him down. Because you can do up to 5 million if you know what you're doing. See, this sucks right here. What is this, man? Okay, I gotta make sure I get that that Gotenks to have his special, which I might have to swap him right there. I hate this. Mmm. Let's see. Because we can't do anything with anybody, basically. I'm kinda screwed. I might lose. I, th I think I'm going to lose. I might have to use a Dragonstone to beat this because I don't see any way of getting around this. But whatever. We'll see what we can do. So we got that right there. I don't want to use those purples. I'm saving those for Gotenks. Hopefully we can seal Goku off and then just survive the turn. That's the key. Come on. <sighs> Not even close. Okay, well, we pretty much are going to lose this. I'm going to use a Dragonstone just to show you guys how to do it. Um, but I should be able to get a nice hit off to at least give you an example. Because my team really just isn't, yeah, see, pfft, destroyed. Uh, my team really isn't up to par to hold on to these kind of guys. I just, I just don't, yeah, we're going to use that. Okay, give me my next people. Okay, still not a very good position, honestly. But we can work with it for sure. So, what you want to do is you want to take the strength one, I believe. Turn all blue to red. Then we got all red to orange. And then all orange to purple. And then all purple to green. So you're going to use the strength. So that's going to change a lot of them to red. One. <laughs> and then we're going to use a physical. And 
And then we're going to use this guy. And I'm not really sure how well that Goku's secondary. I might be able to beat him on this turn. It all depends because he's not that powerful. Either way, then we're going to change the purple to green. This is going to give you a lineup of all of them being green. So basically, this Goku right here. I can survive that first hit because I resist, obviously. And then hopefully I can do it again with the second Goku, but I might not. We'll see how much damage we get off. So we're just going to ride down the middle. See how this is burst on everything? No matter where you go, you're going to hit every sphere. So let's go right down the middle. See, only 95,000. That really is not that much in my opinion. Um, I'm going to try... Because I, I won't be able to survive another turn. I just don't have the characters to do it. So we're going to try this again just to give you the example. So blue to red. Red to orange. I don't like how there's rainbow spheres. That's a really annoying thing. Because it just it makes the attack way weaker than it needs to be. Key spheres to purple. Purple to green. Cool. So this one's, eh, I mean, it's not bad by any means, but it's just, it's not as good as it could be. He's going to get a nice boost, for sure. Yeah, 120,000, that might, if we can survive, that might take him out, honestly. Ooh, we'll have to see how that does. So we got three super attacks going off. He starts out with fucking Dragon Fist, sorry for the language. Let's see how, oh, okay, it's still, it's okay, we resist it. Okay, so this is going to hurt. So 301,000, that's nothing though, honestly. For 239,000 overall power up, 282,000. See, I'm not even getting the kind of damage I want to get. It's good damage. Don't even get me wrong, it's good damage. But it's just, it's not what I need. So, he is on his last bar of health. We can try, hopefully, hopefully Whis can come through for me here. Because if Whis can come through and stall him out, we might have a chance to do this still. Okay. Red, yeah, I mean, it's not really going to do anything. <sighs> I should have put... I should. Okay, we did get Doken. Not really going to do anything still. If Whis can stall him out, we might just win on this turn. But we'll see what happens. Come on. Yes! Got the stall out. God of Destruction's companion. Dope. That's the reason I keep Whis on my team right there. One, two, three, four, five, six. Give me that seven, baby. Doken mode activated. This is not going to do much because it is a resisted overall hit, even though it is. I should have put Goten, uh, Goten there. I should have looked. It's attack all, whatever. It's fine. But we did stall him out. So that's, that's the key important part. See right there where he doesn't attack? That's a stall out right there. Okay. We can do this then. Give me some good, good, good green ones. And I can finish this right here. So we are going to use all the purples just because why not? Okay, damage, I suppose. Okay. This should logically be able to finish him. If that does some good damage, 36,000. Eh. We can at least survive to get this Goku to do something. So we're going to go for the green. 13,000 is decent, not good. Okay, this should be able to finish him. Let's see. I'm still learning about this game myself. Okay, got it. Okay, so see right there. That's how you're going to beat that kind of thing is by nuking. And I only got one Awakening Metal, but that's okay. If I gotta spend a Dragon Stone to get an Awakening Metal, I'm fine with that. Because the character I'm trying to get from beating that, and I'm super excited right now because be, I haven't beat that before, but the character I'm trying to get from beating that is uh, Super Saiyan Goku. I believe it's Super Saiyan 2 Angel Goku is what he changes into. So we got the rank up on that one. Okay, we got the Surpassing All Metal, which I'm gonna have to get two more of, I believe. Uh, let's see. If I was going to Awaken this Goku right here, so he's the one I'm trying to get those medals for. So he's already a UR and you can awaken him to an LR. I believe it's an LR. I don't, he may not be. But it sets you back at level 1 essentially and then you go to 120. So it'll work out in the end. But that's the core mechanics of how to nuke. So you want to have a character. This guy does work. If your team is good enough, you can use someone along these lines. I got him from the GT Saga. It does work with the attack plus 7 for every key sphere obtained. It's just a little more difficult. You're going to have to get 3 to 4 to 5 of those really strong hits off. But you can do it. It's just it makes it a lot easier if you had that physical Goku or that I mean, physical Vegeta, Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan, it's the blue hair. Or you have the uh, tech. There's a couple other ones too. You got the Goten. He's all right. I believe Cell has it as well, but it could be wrong. Um, but yeah, just you can honestly just Google it. I don't know off the top of my head. I could Google it for you, but 
Yeah, either way. Um, but yeah, just look into that. It's really not that hard to do once you get the team properly set up. Make sure you have something to combat the first two guys who come up, which is those physical Gokus. Good couple strength characters. And then have a good couple tech characters, like that Whis came in clutch right there. I would have had to use another Dragonstone. I would have done it, but I only have six, so <laughs> I would have done it. But uh, make sure you just, you know, keep an eye on that kind of stuff. Make sure you keep your characters. If you think somebody's even remotely good, just hang on to them. Just friendly advice, because you can always open up another five slots for one Dragonstone. And Dragonstones do get really, really scarce at the end of the game, I know that. I don't even know how to get them anymore without just having like two come my way a day from gifts or whatever else. So, I don't know. Either way, thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy and you did learn something, make sure you leave a like, comment, and subscribe. It is really much appreciated. And uh, yeah, you have yourself a great day. Bye.